Good morning, fourth graders. Hope you guys are doing well today. Happy Monday. Um, okay, so for this week's project, what you guys are going to be doing is you guys are going to do a self portrait with words. Okay, so this project is pretty cool. Um, I'm going to do like a step by step tutorial on how to do this. Um, so we're going to start with a circle for the face and then like the neck and then the body. Um, and what you're going to do is you're going to write words that describe you. So it can be like fun facts about you. It can be um, things that you're up to right now, the things that you like. Um, so for example, um, around my eyes, I put my eyes... I think I put my eyes are brown and I put my eyes and I continued it over here are brown my eyes are brown then I gave it you know some eyelashes a little dot there um my favorite movie is Titanic and those are like my eyebrows my nose here I put um my fave scent is campfire so the one thing that you guys need to remember too when you're doing this is that there needs to be a dot in front of each sentence um, so like there's the dot here and then you'll just know that it continues there. Um, okay. So like here, like on my part, like my hair part, it says, I love burritos. And then like for my hair here, just for an example, I put my first name starts with AC and ends with NA. Um, so there's just like a bunch of little facts here. Um, so like right here, I put, I love being Catholic. Um, let's see, Star Wars is the best, um, white is, oh, okay, right here, I love the color gray, white is second best, um, let's see, my second favorite movie is Sixteen Candles, Darth Vader is my fave, um, okay, so that's just, like, a little example for you guys, okay? So let's get started. So I'm going to show you guys just how to do the face, the neck, and then the um, actual like shirt. And then I will start writing things. Um, I mean, it's already here, but I'll kind of show you guys like how to start writing alongside like the face and then the mouth too. Oh, that was a good one. I love ice cream when it's cold, bubble gum. So like I put what something I like to eat. Um, like my favorite thing to eat was, you know, ice cream. You don't have to put like what your favorite food is by the mouth, but that was just an idea and like scent because it's a nose, but you don't have to do that. It's up to you if you want to or not. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, so I'm going to be working, you know, upside down and then I'll show you guys. Okay. So first you're going to start with like an oval for the face. Okay. And then your neck. And then just a shirt. So that's just kind of your outline, okay? And then if you guys look here too, so it's a little bit bigger on these sides and that sides, and that's showing like where your ears are, okay? Okay, so for example, so I'm gonna start just putting like my eyelids here, okay? And then I'm gonna say my eyes are and then I can write like brown in here brown remember that dot there and then how about I can put like a heart there just to fill it in okay and then I'm gonna do the same thing here so my eyes are brown See how I did a little curve there to show like the the round part inside my eyeball. Okay, give myself some lashes. If you're a boy, if you want to give yourself lashes, you can. Because boys have lashes too. They're just not as curly as girls. Okay. All right. So the eyebrows, I put. I started a sentence here, so I put my favorite movie is. Titanic okay so like those are my brows my favorite movie is Titanic okay 
Okay, so the nose can be hard. So if you want to do like a nose that's shaped like that, or maybe you want to do like a more pointier nose, you can do it like that and then just right alongside there. Um, however you want to do your nose is totally fine. Okay, or maybe you just want to do like a little button nose. You can do that and then right alongside there. It's up to you. Okay, hopefully you guys can see my pencil marks. Um, if not, I'll take photos of this for you. Okay, so my favorite scent. So, I'm just going to do the outline. So I'm going to put, um, I'm going to write like upside down. So my favorite, you know what, I'm going to put fave in the middle of the space. Oops. So, like, okay, let me show you guys really quick. So on this part here, I didn't put, like, the line. I just wrote it out. So if you want to do it like that, that's fine. Or if you want to actually, you know, do the form of the nose and then right around it, it's up to you, okay? My fave scent is campfire. If it goes up a little bit, that's fine, okay? Okay, and then the mouth, but I love to eat ice cream. Then I put one, it's cold, but you don't, I mean, I didn't have enough space right now. Then I just put my favorite flavor, bubblegum. Okay, then remember the line, or the dot, excuse me starting a sentence that's just for you to like go back and say oh what was i talking about oh there's my beginning point there okay and then let's see um so for the hair i just put i love burritos so that's like my part and then i put like sentences down here so i put my first name starts with a C and ends with an A. If you want to start curving out, you can. Like, it's a strand of hair. Okay. And then I put, I have three sisters and one brother okay if you want to put a little period you can because it is a sentence and then I started talking about Starbucks at some point <laughs> without getting to the Starbucks over here so if you want to start the sentence going this way you can or maybe you want to go this way it's up to you okay so my fave drink is coffee. Iced Oops. coffee is the best. And you can bring it over here. Okay, and then I started talking about, let's see. Oh, I have no pets, I put I have no and then, oh, okay, I mentioned Star Wars. Star Wars is the best. Okay, looks like I have short hair. And then if you want to add, you know, more, more sentences down here so it could look like curls going that way or maybe like little ringlets um, or maybe you just have like straight hair, you can just go down. You can go all the way down here if you want. Totally up to you. And then I put, um, so like I always wear like a bar necklace. Okay, so I put, I always wear a little bar necklace. Okay. And then I put, I love being Catholic. Okay. Then I can put um something.
making sure like I love tacos. Okay, I am that I love spending time with family. Okay, and then so I put like a little pocket here and then I just put like a little fun fact about me and shirts. But um, let's see. I could wear a t-shirt every day. And then maybe like a little heart just to fill that little part in there. Okay. And then you guys don't forget your names too. Okay. So write your name at the top. If you're doing this in your sketchbook, which you can because you have your sketchbook, um, put the date too. So what is today? The 30th? I'm going to put um, 3-30-20. Okay. And then, okay. So if you wear glasses, you can actually put your glasses in there too and then write like more little fun facts about you. Whoopsie. Um, if you have different features on your face, maybe you have like a, like a beauty mark or something, you could put like a little like circle and then just write something along the circle. Or maybe you have little freckles, you can do little dots if you want. Or if you don't want to do a circle with little words, you can just do your little beauty mark. Um, so today all we're going to do is just um, make our face and our neck and our our shirt there and then write our words about each other or about yourself excuse me and then on Wednesday we're gonna give this a little background okay so again if you want to add like longer strands of hair you can I'm gonna just stick with this obviously my hair is not that short but it'll do for now it's fine <laughs> um, but this concludes it I'll take photos I'll put it all on um, Edmodo for you guys and I will see you guys on Wednesday I hope you guys have a great day. Happy Monday and see you guys later. Bye.